Hello everyone, welcome in Crochet Life and Stuff with Deborah. Uh, happy Christmas. Today, as you probably saw from the title, it's for the Secret Santa um, that I participated in with uh, Miss Lisa Ladybird Loves. She coordinated the whole kit and caboodle. And I actually opened it on her crazy six day live, which is still going on if you're watching it before, I don't know, next year sometime. <laughs> She's nuts, okay. Um, my secret Santa is from Australia. And I just want to go through and show you because I had recorded what I was doing at the same time as I was on her live and it just, I didn't like the way it turned out. So I just want to show you because everyone should know what these wonderful gifts are. Um, my secret Santa is a wonderful person named Helen. She lives in Australia. She doesn't have a channel. I can't link her anywhere, but oh my goodness, can she give a gift? Okay, first off, there was the blue heart on the package because we had to do that when we sent our secret Santa and I behaved myself. She sent this off very early. This has been sitting in my room for more than a month just taunting me because I hate waiting to open mail but I didn't even take off the paper on the outside because I knew that uh yeah I would kind of go crazy on the inside was this box which was almost Deborah proof at opening because you know Deborah proof packaging is a thing and I opened it up and actually this box can be reused and it's also a mailing box it actually tells you put postage on it and it's got the front postage on the bottom and I just think that's cool and clever. Okay, I'm gonna set this aside for a minute because I want to show you all of the cool things that I got and they won't necessarily be in the same order. If you want to see the original thing, go to uh, the 25th, Saturdays, uh, Lisa's Live, which will probably be up for a while um, so you can catch up. You can kind of scroll because it's like a 12 hour live and find me in my red and black and you'll see me there. Um, I want to show you, I'm gonna start with some of the little things. Oh my gosh, they're all just wonderful. This cute little bag, and this was tied in a bow, little Christmas bag. It's cloth. It's so stinking adorable. Um, some wonderful lotion. This is hand and nail cream. Yes, I have opened it. Yes, I have used it. Yes, it smells delightful because this is orange with lemon rind. I love citrus. I love oranges and lemons and all that good stuff. So, wow, nice choice. Uh, okay, let me go to this next. And if you watched in the live, I actually put this right on. This is a beautiful scarf. Um, it says, this beautiful Rafal accessory has been hand woven in India from only the finest pure Australian merino wool. Luxurious to the touch and soft to the skin. Yes, it is. As our favorite bag of day would say, it's totally scarfable. It was made by the artisans skilled in ancient traditions, which had been passed down through generations of craftsmen in the villages and towns of India. Wear it with pride, it will not disappoint you. And, oh my goodness, I want to show you. This is beautiful. <clears throat> and it goes to the ends with this lovely striping and little fringy kind of details. And immediately, while sitting in the live, I put it on. It's a bit warm in the house for me to wear a scarf. I don't care. It doesn't even go with what I'm wearing. I don't care. I had to put it on because it's absolutely gorgeous. Okay. Um, this I thought was very, very clever and cool. This is 60 crochet edge designs. It's like a little booklet sold and distributed in Australia by my art company, Party Limited. Um, someplace in New South Wales, it says, but wow the details on this and you know what i was kind of looking at the patterns a little while ago yeah there's a lot of words a lot of fancy details and stuff and this is made for like thread however in my world you either get out magnifying glasses and spotlights to be able to see that stuff or yeah just bump it up to a bigger size and that is what i'll do oh, they are just beautiful look at that and the directions, along with the picture, I think I could follow. 
if I could focus for long enough. But that is just the coolest thing. And I've just decided, well, I'm not going to save this. I'll save this for last, what's in my lap. Also got something that I have not tried yet that I will save for a Snacks Around the World. Tim Tams! I have heard everybody talking about Tim Tams. I've wanted to try them. And right now they're going to stay, stay nestled in this little box so that I don't eat them until I'm ready to record my Snacks Around the World. Um, yes, I'm excited about that. And this. The reason I waited till last to show this was because I nearly cried when I opened it up and I saw this. This says right on the corner, made for Deborah, Georgia, USA, by Helen, Victoria, Australia, Secret Santa 2021. Okay. Little personalized thing there. Oh my gosh. That is awesome. And I'm going to show you the backing fabric first. It's a quilt. It is actually an honest to goodness quilt. Okay. Look at that backing fabric and tell me that's not me. The kitties, the purples and blues. Oh my gosh. But, but then there's the rainbows. That is amazing work. I don't quilt. There's just too much fussy little bitty things for me to, to contend with, but I admire it. Look at this. Helen, this is beautiful. And I am so stinking thrilled for this. Yes. <laughs> I actually took it in the other room with me and I had it folded up and sitting behind me um, when I was recording my vloggy thing earlier today. So if you saw that, you saw it sitting back there. I wanted so badly just to pick it up and go, oh my gosh, look. But I didn't because I knew I was going to come back in here and record this. So there is that and also you know i do a postcard swap and uh i've got information in the in the description below about that but look at this postcard that was in there all of those scenes are so beautiful and this there's a description on the back saying what they are and where they're from colors of gippsland gypsland i'm not sure how to pronounce it properly um but yes, now she put a beautiful note back here and she actually printed it out like from a computer printer, probably because I have a hard time reading my own handwriting, let alone anyone else's these days. It says, hello, Deborah, or actually I should say good day. <laughs> I'm not a blogger or a vlogger, not on Instagram or Facebook, but I do randomly sew, quilt, knit, and crochet. Wow. Abby from Blue Heart Crochet, Hi, Abby. Mentioned that Lisa from Ladybird Loves was running a secret Santa. So I thought that sounded like something I would like to be a part of. And I'm so glad you did. I didn't know who you were until I was picked as your secret Santa. Started watching your channel, which I enjoy very much, and I'm now a subscriber. Thank you, Helen. Yes, I know you will need a spotlight and a magnifying glass to crochet any of the edgings in the booklet. But I thought with a larger hook and thicker yarn, they might make a nice border around a throw rug or even a shawl. Absolutely. flippin -lutely. Here's a trick for when you are eating the Tim Tams. Oh my gosh, Tim Tam instructions right here, okay? Bite a small piece off each diagonal corner of a biscuit. And that's a cookie, a cookie or a, crack, a bar like that for those of us here in America. Yeah. Uh, place one bitten end into a cup of tea or coffee and suck it like a straw. Quickly take the biscuit out of your drink. Put all of it in your mouth at once. Not elegant, but delicious. I'm on board. Okay, that's I will be trying that. As for the patchwork quilt, oh my gosh, not perfect, but finished. There are some faint chalk marks on it, even though I washed it twice. Hope you and your loved ones have a Merry Christmas and a happy and healthy New Year. Kind regards, Helen. P.S. I live in the Gypsum region of Victoria, hence this postcard. That postcard is stunning. I could see any of these images being prints, you know, on a canvas on the wall. Wow, I'm kind of afraid of Australia because in the words of anybody who's written any news stories about it, everything there wants to kill you. I don't mean the people. I mean, you know, spiders that are this big and, and stuff like that. Um, but that, wow, that's amazing. Helen, I appreciate this so much. It really totally made my day. Um, 
I can't stop smiling. Oh, and I forgot to show y'all the awesome paper that everything was wrapped in. Look at this. Look how beautiful that is. This is some lovely, lovely tissue paper and very detailed on it. Um, I, I folded it all very nicely, except for the one that my cat tried to attack, eat, and then lay on. Cat, you know. Um, but yes, I've been just tickled about this all stinking day. And I <laughs> this just gets me. Rainbows, cats. What more do you need? <laughs> Thank you so much. The Secret Santa has been a lot of fun for me. And boy, the anticipation. Um, it's just awesome. So much awesome. Thanks everyone for coming in and checking out the Secret Santa today. Um, if you had a Secret Santa, make sure you tell me about it and I can come watch your video if you have one. And hopefully I will see you very, very soon. Bye y'all.